Hey love bugs, it's Riles. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming, um, stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown, extended, beautiful family, as always, thank you so much for the love and support. It is so, so tr appreciated. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste. Love and blessings. Love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have uh, been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please drop a line. I would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. And um, if you feel like the videos just give you a good vibe, please, you know, go ahead and... Uh, know share will be greatly appreciated and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and you know with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you uh you know i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video sending so much love and light and protection and uplift it as well you know go go ahead and let people i know i'm divinely protected <laughs> whatever you try to bring towards me there's going to be some harshness or evil intent to distract or destroy it's going to turn right back to sender except i send mine with love and blessings uplift and compassion so um the video i'm about to do today is called twin flame 101 hey, um hey oka something serious is taking place that's why uh evil energies are trying so hard uh playing devil's advocate it is so daggone true there's so many different things that's going on right now where you have to stay prayed up where i mean i woke up at like what was it like two o'clock in the morning straight up out my sleep seeing different images is taking place where it's like you got to stand on guard like you're seeing um like way i'm seeing it it's like energies it's, it's just like we're here but i don't know if anybody ever seen constantine where like he was holding that cat and he was you know in los angeles and it's just like shoot los angeles like it feels like it's the hell's gate or something like that if anybody ever seen buffy the vampire slayer that's what it feels like um but it, it's just like he's seeing it and all of a sudden he got himself in you know, you seeing all these different things, and you smell sulfur and rotted meat and junk, all like that. And it just made me really feel like we're in hell already. It's like when we pass away, that's when we go to heaven. Because it, it's just like when you're just seeing different things where you're trying to show love and kindness to people, you know, you're, you're really seeing how people are just really in, in war with themselves. Because it was just like this man, um, I, don't, I think he's an anchor or a news reporter or whatever. He lost his son yesterday. I don't know what happened, but it was just heartbreaking. And um, he was only six years old. And it was just the way people were being so rude and, and sinning that, you know, this is what your God did for taking him or he deserved to die. And I'm like, I hope and pray that somebody didn't procreate with you. <laughs> I'll say if the energy you throwing out, I hope somebody wasn't dumb enough to procreate with you. But if it is, it's just like, you know, your your whatever from what I'm seeing and I'm feeling is like whatever is being pushed out is about to be unleashed on that person. That's why they always tell us, don't wish bad on anybody. Do not. Just whatever is taking place into your life, you pray for your enemies. You pray for yourself. You pray for your healing. Cause universe is telling us, you know, your 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 power as soon as I said that I get got that on chills. Um your power and your potential is really being tested right now. That's why it's just like if you've been going through a huge purge and clearing, you're going through a lot of spiritual, uh, spiritual flus, ascension flus, um, kundalini um, uh, ascension symptoms and stuff like that. Because it's like from what I'm hearing, it's ascension flus and it's spiritual flus. So everything is heightening to you. So you're getting very sensitive. And it, it's just like, um, I'm, I'm sensitive towards anybody, especially it, it's just like when you have lost a parent or, I mean, you lose it anybody, but I feel like the worst thing is when you lose a child that hasn't even got to be fresh out the womb and really, you know, really live in life. You're six years old and you're hearing people wishing worse on, on somebody who's already going through stuff. You're trolling people that are sending love out to somebody. And I'm like, what is wrong with the world today? You know, it, it's just like every time you turn around, somebody's getting robbed at gunpoint. Um, you can't go to school or, you know, the thing, I guess, that happened at that mall. I didn't really go into coverage about it and read about it because I said it's just becoming too much. It's been very heavy, you know, and you're knowing you're doing a lot of clearing because it's like you can't deal with the nonsense that's going on in the world. You know, you probably already don't listen to the news and the different things that they place on social media, but now it's getting more intense. 
Like, I'm like, uh uh-uh, uh, I'm not about to deal with it. I'm already dealing with my own stuff. Let me just send love and light to this because there's just too many different things that's going on. I'd rather hear about the good things that's going on in the world. I ain't trying to be, even though you can't be ignorant to what is going on in the world, but there's only so much you can do as a person because it's just like if you know, even one person can't cure the world of the madness that's going on, but if it, it, it just takes that one person or that that two people or that three people that you're pushing some kind of love to you don't know how that can transfer to somebody else because it's like right now there's a lot of energy that's out here like you'll see different things it's like you can see dark shadows towards people you can probably see it like when you're doing a, mo a lot of emotional clearing you'll see something move past and you're just like you know and I tell people all the time I, you know I'm, I'm strongly connected to spirit it'll be different times where I'll see like It'll be trying to find attachments, but you know if you're um, anointed and stuff like that, it can't attach to you like that. It can't be placed on you. It, you, it can try to get around you, but it's like you got a force field bubble. The more you keep healing, the stronger that that shield gets. You know you've been divinely protected since you were. You know you came out the womb, even though it felt like you doing from the womb. You are already on that assignment. You're knowing your assignment, and you got to keep going. But you'll see the different things that's going on in the world because it's just like something big is coming from. God that's the reason why the devil's trying to it's his hardest to stay keeping mess going on so it's just like now you won't have to make a choice you know and there will be different things that's going to truly test you in your peace there'll be different things that's going to be blocked or you may hear stuff like oh, okay you, you know um, say that you about to get a blessing today and stuff like that. You you know it, it's just like anything God does. He he's gonna announce it when that mess happens. He ain't gonna give you you know he ain't gonna sit up here and give you an exact time or exact day. If he do, you know you, you gotta got a heavy heavy strong uh, thing. But it'll be a different thing where you have to really you know right now it, it's just like when I'm trying to see how they're trying to get me to say this. Uh, you're, you're clearing a lot so when you're clearing a knot and you're getting in that new vibration it's going to be tested like it, it's, it's really going to have you feeling like God is lying to you or he'll give you a certain time a certain date and then that's going to flow through and it'll be making you look at God like you, you a clown you this and this and this and that and that's the devil doing that so it's just like you you'll it's, it, it'll be just when it from what spirits tell me right now it's like when this happens there ain't gonna be no question it's just like boom it's gonna happen it ain't going like it, is it gonna happen today or is it gonna happen in five minutes or is it coming yet you know like when you get ready to do, you know when something coming as soon as i've seen it, i've seen a flash come up um as soon as it's coming you'll know because it's gonna be something so divinely orchestrated it's gonna have you shook you know you gonna know exactly when it's coming don't allow yourself to get you know because the devil come up in there and start getting all up in your head when you're getting close to something and this is like right now he trying to play, play a huge distraction you know a huge distraction it's just like when i say that god is doing some kind of factory reset because it'll be different things where you, when i feel it it's just like ooh. When I'm, when I'm saying, when I'm seeing the things that I'm seeing, it, it's just like, it make me want to crawl in a hole, like one of them things, like uh, what was on Deep Impact, when they had that place where it had all the animals, all the vegetables, this is the stuff they've been sitting up here stocking up for, you know, for years, it's like you had to have a lottery, I want to just go in there, <laughs> and not come out until, you know, I feel like it's okay to come out, that's the stuff that I'm seeing, but you, it, it's just like, you know, when you're going through you can wake up and be peaceful and it'll make you just want to stay in your in your your little peaceful incubator right there because as soon as you step out you feel the war zones with everybody that is not you know they want to stay focused and not appealing to what universe and you know God and them are telling them so this is that time where you have to really stay focused you know, you're feeling like different things is taking place into your life. This is the reason why you're going through these heavy spiritual uh, changes right now. Going through hot and cold, hot and cold. You know, you can be highly emotional, agitated. You know, you're, you're more in your feelings a lot more than you usually are. You may go through a state of confusion. You may be flighty. 
you know, you may be going through daydreams and stuff like that. You got head pressure that's coming up from your third eye because it's like wide the heck open. And if it's not, you'll know because um, sometimes people don't know if their third eye is open. And when it does, it's like all that pressure start coming up from here. You know, and you'll sometimes it can get so intense you can hear cracking coming up. And it'll be different times they'll make your eyes bulge out or you've been doing a lot of clearing and you may have been getting different kind of uh like you know like if you have some kind of infection you gotta sit up here and take antibiotics for it and it's like you're doing a detox so sometimes you know tmis ain't had this and women can have you know uh feminine imbalance or yeast infections and stuff like that and trying to get all up into that some people can do that some people can have strep throat um it's sinus infections because when this stuff is starting to come through it can really mess with your sinuses it's like you'll feel all the sinus pressure um it can be with guys you know you you, you know it, it can you can even mess with you down there you know it, it can it can really mess with you down there because you're going through a lot of clearance it, you know either you're not able to go to the bathroom regularly you know your um when they say your sinus, uh, what, what is it? Your solar plexus is active, either actively, uh, very active right now, or is kind of, you know, backed up because there'll be certain things that's still clearing, and you'll feel it because you even feel it either from your shoulders, from the back of the neck, the bottom of the back. As soon as I said that, I keep seeing these diagonal flashes that keeps coming past, but um, your energy is being very intense, and it's just like you, you may have. Uh, you know, um, telling people if you have digital, a lot of digital stuff, or you have like appliances around you, it can start getting faulty. Or it'll be times where you are, you're having to, uh, uh, especially if you have like the watches, the the phone watches, you've been having a you've been having a lot of interruptions with them, or they've been having to be plugged up. You have to get them charged a lot more, even with your phones and stuff like that. And you're you're going through these intense changes, so you'll feel it. And it's like the more you keep clearing out. The more you'll start feeling sensitive towards, you know, you can see somebody is going through some war, and you be like, oh hell no, let me go ahead and back up. You're like, mm mm, hey, how you doing? Keep on moving. You know, you don't want to be in, in that type of vibration with nobody, and you know, you're going through that clearing. So it'll be different things where they're telling you, stay focused, stay focused, because right now you're being tested every single day, and you got people that want to come out and be asinine and just straight ignorant. Please don't allow yourself to do it. If you can some say something, and I mean you know a lot of times it tells you just not even say anything at all the best bet because it, it's just like folks is really want to get stupid right now just to see a rise out of you just don't allow yourself to play play uh with the devil's advocate okay but this is a short uh video i would love to give a post notification shout out to carl fuquet and um um and authentically thinking much love to you and thanks for dropping the line is greatly appreciated i love y'all so much and thank you you know for really you know uh giving me that um that confirmation that you really can feel the different things that's going on that i talk on because there like i said there's a lot of downloads you're getting you're getting a lot of upgrades you're getting a lot of downloads I'm telling you to keep that to yourself okay move you, you, this is at that moment where you got to just all your movements cannot be be exposed to whatever you know you may be happy that you're able to figure certain things out that has been probably a missing confusion even for other people and it's like from what they're saying when you try to talk about it it'll sound like your you know your, your understanding will be defragmented you know it'll be trying to defragment and it's just like some people if it's not meant for them it could be you're talking and when it gets to them it'll be like want 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 they're not supposed to know it so it's just like all the movements you're doing, keep that to yourself. You know, you're going through a lot of different changes and this mess is not easy. It's challenging you every day. And it will keep continuing to do that until you can recognize your own power. Until God and universe feels like you're done. It's like even when you're, you're you know, uh, your karma's clearing, you're still being tested. Just to be able to show you, you have that full p potential to get over anything. You know, you'll have your days when you're not okay. You'll have your days when you're in your emotions. You'll have your days where you just feel like sometimes it make you want to, like, not want to live anymore. I'll just say it like that you know you know, you two getting sensitive about different things um you know have you just very angry that's when that time where you it's right really you're being placed in solitude like you feel more comfortable there 
and this is at a time where you know universe and god really needs your all your attention right now because he wants you to focus on you there's different things that really needs your attention right now that uh is taking place or whatever that is but you know um just allow yourself to understand the assignment like i said i'll leave all my contact information in the description box below it's all about spiritual networking um being able to uh you know, being able to understand the deeper part of purpose that we're taking place in and just being able to understand what's taking place. Because a lot of times people are like, Rosalind, is this normal? I'll tell anybody, if you're a Hayoka, nothing we do is normal. It'll be over the top. It'll be different things that normal people will be like, what? Are you okay? Are you all right? It's just like, it's, I, I, nothing when I, I've seen different things that go on around me. You know, I'll be different things that'll take place on video at the time. I'm like, oh, whoa, I'm glad it was on tape. People would be able to see it, you know, and just go through different things like that. But just being able to have that understanding of, um, you know, um, being able to help each other heal, you know, upgrade and just being able to understand our path, you know, is truly a blessing. And just being able to have that, you know, teacher uh, student situation is just blessed to be a part of other people's lives, being able to do that. And, um, uh, if you're interested in my podcast, I have that as well on my community section of my page um, as well. And, you know, different um, posts and memes, you know, I put out, you know, uh, funny memes is going on. Just to give you an uplift in life. You know, we're going through a lot right now, but a lot of times it's good to, you know, have a good laugh to keep from crying. So just to be able to take your mind off of different things when we're going through major shifts, I try my best to be able to, you know, uh, put that on there, you know, because there's a lot of times we'll be going through some heaviness and you may not be, you know, um, on on the internet like that because I know a lot of y'all that are, you know, subscribe here, you like tell me Rosalind don't have, you know, TikTok or anything like that and you just deal with YouTube. So, you know, there's a lot of times you won't know that there's a big shift happening. Like you'll feel it within your, your within yourself, within your person, but you don't know what's going on into the world. So I try to be able to do that. And just giving you a, a food for thought, you know, friendly reminder, different things you're going through. You know, this is really, really showing you your true potential because a lot of times we go through things and it's like we don't have our Power Ranger energy on every day. And that's fine. But it's just the fact that you sometimes you have to, when you're going through hard stuff like this, you have to understand if they didn't feel like we can overcome the things that are that we're constantly battling, they wouldn't have picked us to be able to do that. And you're always going to be like that, you know, because it's like the devil. The devil can be ugly, but it's just you have to understand your spirit can get a lot uglier. So, you know, keep going. Um, and if you ever feeling generous enough to drop a donation, Cash App is there as well. And um, what else? Anything that you're trying to manifest into your life, I'm sending so many different vibes on what you're, what you may be needing. It's like confidence, you know, uh, compassion within yourself, healing within yourself. You may be a little bit distracted, you know, sending vibrations of being focused, uh, you know, being persistent, you know, just being able to uh, believe yourself and being able to be patient with yourself too, because it, it took a lot to become the person you are right now. So don't ever doubt that. So um, what else? Uh, just keep going. Just stay persistent and consistent, you know, devoted to yourself and determined to yourself. You know, don't stay asleep on yourself. Stay woke. You know, you got a lot of uh, potential. You have a lot of power that you probably don't give yourself credit for. But it's like your enemies know it and the devil, the devil definitely knows that. Because he'll do all he possibly can to make you second guess that. Because you have a blessing that's coming on tomorrow just and he'll make you try to forgive up and doubt yourself today. So keep on going. Much love to you as well. Namaste. Shalom. Um, what is it? I say uh, God bless. Much love to you. You know, even through social distancing with everything that's going on, make sure you give out love, light, positivity, words, vibes, frequencies. Those things can really take somebody a long way. And that light keeps on flashing on. What the heck that is? Um... It can really take somebody a long way just because you're doing it for no, no reason in the world. It can take you any further. Much love to you. Peace.